And welcome back to Flexible Games, where we are playing Bots and Trains in Factorio. So I had to let this run a while. Um, these flying, these robot frames just take forever to make, and I had a lot of robots to upgrade. So I basically just let this thing run for a while and uh, got all of the construction bots upgraded. Um, and now we've got a bunch of logistics. I still have a bunch of Mark IIs out, out in the wild here because I'm not able to grab them. We've pretty much, I mean, I've, I've only got 141 out right now and they're all being used. So as I introduce these into the system, fewer and fewer of the Mark IIs will actually be used. So let's put these out. Oh, look at them go. Nice and fast. Awesome. Now let's find some more robo ports to sort of shove more of these in. Got lots of robo ports around me. I have up I did upgrade a couple of the robo ports to the Mark IIs but only where I needed the extra distance to grab all of the, um, the, uh, the giblets out here. So like this one here is upgraded, but this one isn't. And neither is the one down there. Um, as well as the other side, if you look at the map here, you can see. So over here I have an upgraded one and down here I have an upgraded one just so I can reach the drops and uh, how many construction bots do I have 450 let's make that an even let's make that an even even amount now I should have oh now I have 550 I must have had must have had some on me oh well on to bigger and better things so we've got green circuits being made. We've got quite a few of them as the as the system just processed I was able to uh, build quite a few of them and uh, this is kind of annoying it's pulling out of this one and not that one but I won't I don't care and this coal is gone you still have lots left, so I'm not worried about that. So let's look at inserters would be nice. I also want to start solar energy. I want to get as much of this researched as possible. So to get to this, I need that. And so I could actually research all of these right now. Let's get our research on a little bit. And before I forget, I have all of these being pulled out, but I don't have them delivered because I didn't want I didn't want to pull one out and then use one to deliver it. I wanted to pull as many out as I could. So let's go ahead and just request as many of these as possible. Um, Thought it was in Bob's, yeah. Mark twos. So I want as many of those as they've got, which will produce some more. I also have the bots down in the outposts um, to convert if I wanted to. I could go down there and and just grab the bots, bring bring a couple stacks with me. Grab the ones that are there, come up and drop them off. Shouldn't be too bad. Looks like my cobalt is doing really well. Copper is being consumed. I've, I've got plenty of there. They're not all being used. So let's look at solar. I'm pretty sure I have all the required materials, all the ores and alloys at least to get it started let's get rid of some of these trees there we go and let's 
let's do the last. Oh, I can't do it. I have the other science pack I've got to do. And I believe the other science pack was like another tier of alien research. As you can see, I've actually, I actually did the alien research and now I've got the vanilla purple alien science packs ready to go. I had so many of the pink artifacts that I was able to fill all of those chests and fill up a good, a good buffer for research. However, I'm not sure where that other science pack comes in. So this alien research gives me the gold one. I'm pretty sure it might have been advanced, yeah, advanced research. So this actually uses the express transport belt. And with a MK2 lab, I'm guessing that's just a better lab, faster. So let's research that. I need to get some advanced transport belts or some of, some of the blue transport belts. And let's go down to where my lubricant is. Got lots of it here. Okay, so let's work out something here. So this will be advanced transport belt. Just continuing on the the, the main line here. There we go. Now the, each one of these needs a red and then a yellow. So I'm pretty sure I can do something like this. Because I can make two yellow at a time. So this will be yellow, this will be red and into blue. Well, I need a lot of iron gears for all of this. So each one of these requires iron gears. So let's do something like how do I want to do this? Because these just need gears. It's hoping Hoping to optimize it a little bit better. And this needs gears as well. How many? Five? It's a lot of gears. And I'm not I'm not going to need all that many of these, I don't think. So this will be iron gears and it's intermediates. Okay, this actually needs iron, iron and iron. So let's request some iron. And I need a couple requesters up here. There we go. A little spot for transport belts. Should be able to power it all with that. There we go. There we go, and we've got belts. 
wish I had a way of speeding that up, but unfortunately, that'll eat a lot of iron for the time being. We got the new fast robots going to town. Should be slowly converting over all of the other robots. I've got a whole lot here. I've already converted. Grab this odd stack, put that out in the wilderness. Quite a few bots. Okay, so those are done. And silicon nitride, I'm pretty sure I'm actually producing. I don't know how much though. That's lithium perchlorate. That's not even close. Okay, well, I honestly, that's uh, sodium hydroxide. Silicon nitride. I mean, here's where the silicon is over here. And silicon nitride for Bob's is where would that be hmm there it is no lithium chloride silicon nitride do I have ceramics? Aha, there it is. Powdered silicon and nitrogen. So this introduces the compressed air chain to get nitrogen. I love how all those are trying to optimize my Trying to spread out my power gen a little bit, but it's proving very difficult. So, silicon nitride, powdered silicon, and nitrogen. And nitrogen I get through compressed air in a chemical plant. Okay. Let's plan on a lot of this stuff. Nitrogen. And I'm going to, I don't think I need this, which I would think would be oxygen. So compressed air is an air compressor. See how many, if we can support all of these on one, then great. So 10 compressed air per second. This will use two per second. So yeah, this should be fine. And I keep running out of straight pipe. There we go, and we have venters that we can use. Let's come down with all of this stuff. And then over. Okay, and many white powdery substances in here. Silicon nitride. Powdered silicon. So I think that's just a regular regular thing here. No, I don't need powdered silicon. Why am I not able to see it? I mean, there's the ceramic right there. 
and it's not giving me the option, so maybe it's not a, oh, it's a chemical furnace, that's why. There we go. Silicon nitride. There you go. What's the crafting time on this? Wow, 7.5. Okay. So let's, uh, let's kind of expand that here. And just build. Oops. Oh. I'm still getting used to this mouse. There, it's way more sensitive than my crappy other mouse. Powdered silicon, let's do like 20. Oh, come on. There we go. And I'm going to need a couple. So messy, but again, I'm just learning bobs. This is very much a learning experience for me. All right, well, we have what looks like the last ingredient to get uh, alien research. No, nope, no, nope, the other one, advanced research. I think I did that already. So let's go up to where our research is and look at what the build time is on these. 15 seconds for these. All right, well, let's try to sneak it in here. really no more sneaking anything anywhere. It's pretty compact. Do seven? How many do I have here? I have six here, so that's... Oh. There we go. Okay, these are all going to be the blue science pack. and provider with a limit of maybe one row sounds good and let's uh, copy and paste the requirements and I'll do 10 of each. This is a pretty long crafting chain, so there we go. And let's paste all those requirements. go. Now I just need to power it. And it looks like I can power the whole thing with one. Excellent. Just barely. All right. Well, we have the new blue, dark blue science going. Very, very expensive science. In fact, I'm going to reduce these down to even five. These are really, really expensive science packs. 
So, all right, well, that is science knocked out. I thank you for watching. Stay tuned for more bots and trains. Anyway, I will see you next time.